All right, today we are going to be making salmon fillet roasted in butter and olive oil. First, we've got to get ourselves a nice little saucepan. This one should do. Now we need to melt two tablespoons of butter and two tablespoons of extra virgin olive oil in a saucepan, like that. And then we add half a teaspoon of sea salt. Now we gotta preheat the oven to 500 degrees. Now we get a baking sheet. Or a baking pan, whatever. Also, for a really nice flavor, I got lemon juice. That'll add a really nice tang to it, along with some salt. Now we're gonna take this stuff and then spread it over this baking pan. There, now we got it all spread out on the pan. Now we're gonna put some a tiny, tiny bit of lemon juice in here. Now we place them on the salmon and meat rows. Then I grind on some black pepper, a bit of sea salt. Make sure that's spread. And then a tiny, tiny bit of this basil and parsley mix because this stuff is strong. And now we let it bake for five minutes. What was that? Now after five minutes, we gotta open the oven and carefully turn the salmon and then do it for another five minutes to uh, even it out. Um, the only thing on right now is our oven. Uh, I, I'm, not I'm not sure it's supposed to do that. Uh, wow, oh my god. So this is how the salmon turned out after I pulled it from the oven. The reason the lemons are like this is because we had to, well, flip, we flipped it over after five minutes and then baked it for another five minutes. So now we gotta platter it and see how good we can make it look. Now I've got all the lemons on, so now I'm just gonna wipe around the rim here to make it a bit cleaner on the platter. And now I'm gonna pour all the juices from the baking pan onto the salmon. Now I'm going to squeeze each of the lemons one by one to release some more of the juices back onto the salmon. As you can see, each time I squeeze them, some juice is released. And that is our baked salmon.